The release request procedure has changed just a little bit recently and I wanted to highlight for you what you need to do as an administrator or a principal to uh, approve those release requests. Um, the re release request uh, procedure will be entirely electronic so there will be no need to print anything out anymore or sign anything. So the, the procedure is going to be the same for the teacher. They're going to fill out the release request. They're going to get a confirmation uh, email that they filled it out. And then this is going to send a direct uh, email to Nick Carls, our CNI director there. And once he gets that email, he then goes into that uh, spreadsheet and he puts his initials on it. Once he puts his initials on that uh, approval, you're going to get an email that looks just like this. And when you click on that email, you need to go in there and approve that specific request. So once you've clicked on that, you're then going to get taken to this spreadsheet and you're very simply going to stick your initials in there and click on here and hit resolve. And that's going to send an email to Sarah Terry and then she can process it from here. So it's pretty easy on the administrative end. You're just going to get an email that looks very similar to this. You're going to click on that specific email. You're going to put your initials in there and then you're going to be done. Um, within this spreadsheet that's over here too, if you really wanted to see all the details to that specific request, you can click on that full-fledged form and it will pull up uh, the form with all the information so you can see it nice and easily. So let me know if you have any questions, but we hope this uh, way we're doing things will make things a lot easier and more efficient for everyone.